Hi, my name is Caroline and I'll be showing you Carillon ERP's robust shipping method. This is the second part of our shipping tutorials and will include barcoding, staging, and repacking capabilities. Carillon ERP is ideal for large warehouses that want to utilize barcode scanning and real-time capabilities. In this video, I'll show you everything from purchasing and receiving supplies to making sales orders and delivering your goods. Make sure to see our simple shipping video as well, which is located in the Carillon blog. The first thing I'm going to do is issue a purchase order for the supplies we need. This window is easy to use, but has more robust functionality that we won't go over today. I'm going to select my supplier and vendor and create an approved order. For my company, I'm going to order a case of bells, a case of kickstands, and a case of water bottle holders, and then save the order. Let's flash forward to later on in the week when my warehouse personnel receives the order. To receive inventory, we will be going to the inventory receipts window. This window was designed to be very intuitive and easy to use, and the person receiving the shipment will have all the information they need on the packing slip. The quantity received can either be manually entered or defaulted depending on your preferences. When the warehouse personnel saves the inventory receipt, New barcodes can be printed and placed on the boxes. Now we're going to create an approved sales order for one of our clients. Again, this isn't a demo of our sales order entry window because there's not enough time to properly go through it. To see more of our sales order entry window, check out our video or give us a call. As you can see, I'm selling my bike parts to Bevo's Bike Company. They've bought a variety of different bike parts that need to be delivered to their shop location, including a case of bells, a few water bottle holders, and a few kickstands. When I save this order, I then need to assign sales orders for delivery. Our assigned sales orders for delivery window shows you all of the orders that need to be assigned to a delivery truck. You can assign the orders for a carrier like UPS or FedEx, or you can assign them to your own delivery trucks. Since we are following this one order, I'm going to unassign all of the orders and only assign our order to a truck. When I save this, two things will print out. First, I will receive a new shipping label for the case of bells. Secondly, I will get a pick ticket for the items that need to be repacked. You can customize your pick ticket to look however you want. Let's deal with the box of bells first. Since those don't need to be unpacked and the box doesn't even need to be opened, I like to put that in the staging area first. Your warehouse personnel will take the newly created shipping label and add it to the box. They will then open the staging area scan window and simply scan the barcode. In the staging area, Carillon also has an optional staging area status window that has all of the missing items from the orders that have been released. This window can be displayed on a wall-mounted screen next to the staging area so your warehouse personnel can know what items need to be accounted for. Now, let's deal with the items that need to be repacked to fulfill the order. With Carillon, you can have the pick ticket print straight to your company's repack room. Carillon helps you know what items you need with the repack demand window, a feature that is similar to the staging area status window. 
This window can be displayed on another wall mounted screen within your repack room and will show you all of the items that you need to unpack in order to fulfill the orders. Unpacking a case of items is simple. All your personnel will need to do is go to the transfer and unpack case window and scan the barcode of the case that is displayed on the repack demand window. This action will result in the printing of individual barcodes for your items. After you unpack the case, the repack demand window will update and reflect the changes. When you have the inventory you need ready to go in the repack room, your shipping clerk will go to the repack window and scan the pick ticket with your barcode reader. This window has a remaining tab that will show your clerk what exactly needs to be packed in order to fulfill the order. They will then scan the barcode for the items ordered and the quantity will come up on the window. You won't have to worry about accidentally sending more than what was ordered because Carillon alerts you when you try and scan something that doesn't belong. When you save this window, a new barcode will print out that will tell the system the new contents of the box. The last thing we need to do with these orders is put them on the delivery vehicles. Your shipping clerk will go to the delivery vehicle scan window, enter the delivery vehicle ID, and then scan the labels. For the repacked case, we will only need to scan the one label. But for the case of Bells, or any case that has not been unpacked yet, Carillon requires that you scan both the shipping label and the inventory label that was put on when you received the inventory. This is just another step to help ensure that you are sending the right products to your customer. After the truck is loaded and ready to go, your shipping clerk will go to the ship delivery vehicle window, enter the delivery vehicle ID and date, and press save. When they do that, an invoice will be created, and you can print that invoice for your records. These invoices can be customized to look however you want. Make sure to visit Carillon's redesigned website. For a free personalized demo of Carillon ERP, please call the sales department at 1-800-739-9933. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you soon.